Hello, today we are here with another recipe, Potol Dahlia. So to do that, we are gonna take some Dahlia in a bowl and wash them really properly. So the dust of it is really gonna go away like this, you can see. Now after washing the Dahlias properly, we are gonna heat up a pan and put some white oil in it. So we can fry the pointed gourds and potatoes. After the oil is heated, we are gonna put the pointed gourds peeled and chopped finely. We are gonna fry them until they are golden brown. We are gonna do the same thing to the potatoes as well. Here you can see they are properly fried but there is a little bit of greenish also. This looks really great, you know. So after frying, we are gonna put them out in a bowl and put the potato pieces in for some frying. Now the potatoes are already fried and we are gonna put them out in a bowl. After putting them out in a bowl, we are gonna add a spoon of ghee in the karhai like you can see. Now we are gonna add one by one dried red chilli, cinnamon, cardamom, clove, bay leaf and grated ginger. We are gonna cook it for some time. After shorting for a time, we are gonna give some cashew nuts and raisins or kishmish. Now we are gonna cook it well for some time and add the washed dahlias in the karhai. Now we are gonna add some turmeric powder and cumin seed powder. The amount of the powders are almost half teaspoon. Now we are gonna stir it for some time and add the fried potatoes and pointed gourd. This recipe can also be served as a evening snacks or something. So you can also be full and enjoy something delicious while sitting aside. Now we are gonna add some hot water in it and stir to make all the dahlia soak in the water. After that we are gonna add some salt as per taste, sugar and put the lid on. After 7 minutes we are gonna take the lid off and add 2 green chilies and stir it for some time. At this point we are gonna turn the heat on low flame and put the lid on and cook for another 3 minutes on low flame. After 3 minutes, we are gonna take off the lid and check if the water is already soaked and the dahlias are dry already. So it's dried. Now we are gonna add some ghee and top up with some garam masala. And it will be ready to serve on plate. I will recommend everyone to try it at home because it is really easy to make for anyone and you know it is really unique to serve and it tastes also really great here you go as the dish was so delicious after tasting it i can't help but showing you thumbs up at last before serving i decided to serve with some technique like you know tomato flour i have made it with my own hands and some coriander leaf you can see how beautiful it looks you know, the taste can't be tasted with eyes, but the looks can really increase the person's hunger. Until the next video, bye!